Hello Lobos and Canvas learners. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create an online assignment that your students can submit in Canvas. So as with pages, you have two different options. You have the option to build an assignment from the sidebar or from the module level. I'm going to be creating from the module level. Start out by hitting the gray plus sign button and then select assignment from the drop down. New assignment because I don't have any built and then give the assignment a name. And then you add the item. Then I'm going to click on the title to view and then I'm going to click edit so that I can make changes. You'll notice this is the same text editor that you have when you create an announcement, pages, or discussion. I'm going to start out by adding my text instructions. What's cool about this is I can actually add a video into my assignment as well. So I come here and look uh, for whatever I'm looking for, in this case, chapter 12 of this book. I'm going to say embed medium, and I'm going to be able to pop that in. And I'm just going to hit enter so it moves down below. I'm actually going to make this part a little bigger because it's my actual assignment. And I'm going to bold this just so it really stands out. All right. So now I'm going to go down here and actually start building out the due dates and points and those pieces that go along with an assignment. So really up to here, this is very similar to a content page. Here's where it starts to branch out a little bit. So I'm going to say that this is worth 100 points, and I'm going to say it's a percentage. And then I'm going to come here. And please, this is the part that I really want you to notice is this submission type window right here. All right, submission type, we're going to select online. So you have on paper, external tool, and submission, but because I'm showing you an online assignment, you're going to select online. And then you have options here. So I'm going to say they can do text entry, or they can do a website URL, or they can do a media recording. I'm going to leave it flexible. So I know I said write up in my instructions, but if a student came to me and said, could I record my summary, this would be a way for them to be able to do that. So those are my options that I'm going to leave. It is not a group assignment and I'm not going to require peer reviews. Those will be videos you'll learn about later. And I am going to assign it to everyone. This is what um, one of the things about Canvas that I really like. So it's due. Let's pick a due date. Let's say that it's due on Tuesday the 26th. However, it's available from today until Friday the 29th. Why are these dates different? Well, this is my due date. But this is that three-day window or whatever your, your grading policy follows that says I can accept late work for additional days. So this just kind of gives some cushion time for your students who may not be able to adhere to this May 26 deadline. And of course you can adjust this as you need to. But that does build it in. So even though it's due on the 26th, it will be available until the 29th at midnight. All right, so then I'm going to say save and publish. And now that online assignment is there and viewable by my students. I'm going to switch over to student view and show you what this looks like. So you have two ways that you can get to student view. The first way is from home. So right here on the side, you have student view. All right, there's my content pages. And then here's my assignment that I just made. And so right here, they click on submit assignment and then they could actually type because I gave them the text entry option. They could do website URL because they could actually link into a Google Doc. Media, this is where they could record or upload an audio or video or a Google Drive. That would be if they had already created a doc um, similar to the website URL and they wanted to just link it to the actual document versus giving me the share link. So those are some different options there and then they would hit submit assignment. So that is how you create an online assignment that your students would complete within Canvas. As always, if you have any questions, please reach out to any member of Digital Learning. We'd be happy to help support you.